Do you want to run large language models locally on your computer? In this video, we're going to install Olama, which is a program that allows you to run large language models locally on your PC, and as well OpenWeb UI. OpenWeb UI is a graphical user interface which allows you to speak to your large language model the same way as you also communicate with ChatGPT, for example. Let's not wait any longer, let's start right away. Okay, let's get started with installing Olama. So just navigate to olama.com, click on download. Just download Olama for the operating system that you are using. And as soon as the download has been finished, click on the file you just downloaded in order to start the installation process. And the installation process of Olama will be started. So you have just successfully installed Olama, but you also want to install the large language model itself. In order to do that, uh, navigate to olama.com, navigate to models, and you see here all the different models that uh, are available for Olama. And the model that I want to install today is Llama 3.1, which is quite a recent model which has been released by Meta. So I'm going to click on Llama 3.1. And now you will see that there are uh, three different versions available. So you have the 405B model, that's a model that requires uh, 331 gigabyte of RAM, the 70B model that will run on some of your PCs, and as well the 8B model. Uh, in this case, I'm just going to click on the 8B model. And of course, larger models commit higher performance. But for this video, I'm just going to choose for the 8B model. And then you will see here the commands that you can use in order to install and run this model. So what I'm going to do then, uh, just copy this one, then navigate to the Windows symbol at the bottom of your PC, press CMD, and this will open a terminal on your computer. And in this terminal, you're just going to press paste, and you can do that by clicking on the right button of your mouse like this, then you're going to press enter and the model will be installed and it will as well be running. So the model is now installed and is running and you can now ask it a question, for example, why is the sky blue? And we get the result. Something that is also quite helpful, you can as well press slash question mark. Then you can see all the comments that you can uh, use in Olama. So one of the things you can do is asking for a list of all the models installed on your system. You can do that by typing slash list. And you'll see that I currently have one model installed, which is the Llama 3.1 8B model. So I'm going to close this terminal. Just be aware that anytime you want to run this model, you're going to open CMD again. And then you're going to press Llama run Llama 3.1 8B in order to run this model. And of course, if you want to install any more models, just navigate to the model section and find the model that you want to install in Llama. So in this next step, we're going to install a program that's called OpenWeb UI. And that's a program that you currently see on my screen. So you can select the model here. Uh, you, of course, you have to make sure that Olama is running. And then you can just use um, Olama the same way that you also use, for example, ChatGPT, with a really nice uh, graphical user interface and as well with separate threads. And in order to install OpenWeb UI, we also need another application, which is called Docker. And you can download this program for free. So you can just navigate to docker.com and then click here on uh, download for Windows or any operating system that you are running. Um, and just make sure that you install this program on your computer. And once you have done this, I'm not going to show all the different steps. As soon as you've installed Docker, we're going to navigate to the GitHub page of OpenWeb UI. We're going to scroll down. And uh, we're going to scroll until you find um, if Olama is on your computer, use this command. This is part of the installation with default configuration. Then you see here uh, a Docker command, which is referring to the Docker application that we've just installed. Make sure that you copy this entire string by clicking on this button here. Then open the terminal and you can either uh, open a new terminal by clicking here on the Windows logo and navigate to CMD. Um, or you have to make sure that you close Olama. So what we can do is we give the um, command slash by here in order to close Olama. And then we're going to paste the command here to uh, install OpenWeb UI via Docker. So that's this one. And then make sure that you press enter in, in order to install OpenWeb UI. I'm not going to do this because I already have it installed on my computer. And once you have closed the terminal, we're going to open the Docker desktop application. So you can do that via the desktop or you can do that via the icons here. Um, so you see that here Docker is running. So um, I can pop it up my screen here. Now you will see that OpenWeb UI is running here. And you see here the ports. And if you click on this symbol, you will you will launch the website where OpenWeb UI is running on your local system. So click here. I will now see that I can select a model. 
Now, if you don't see any model here, uh, for example, Llama 3.1, just make sure that your model is running. So in order to do this, open the terminal again. And then let's run uh, Llama 3.1 like this. And as soon as Llama 3.1 is running like this, you should be able to find the model here on your screen in OpenWeb UI. And you can select it here. And as soon as you have selected it here, you can ask it questions. I will see here the answer of the Llama 3.1 uh, model with 8 billion parameters. Now, I really hope this video was useful for you. If it was, please give it a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, post them in the comments and I will try to help you as good as possible. And I hope to see you in my next video.